The University of Alabama's Million Dollar Band is preparing for their season opener with four new drum majors. Two of them are from right here in Huntsville. Wait, the ones Demetria Green drove down to Tuscaloosa to see how they're preparing for this Saturday's season opener against Middle Tennessee. And spoiler alert, it's a lot of work. Nothing compares to the excitement of game day. The plays. The fans. The Million Dollar Band. But first, there's practice. Da -da. Da -da -da. Hours and hours of it. We like to say that they work almost as hard as the Crimson Tide football team. From 8 a.m. until 9.30 p.m. under the glaring sun and what feels like 100 degrees while carrying 40 pounds of equipment. This is definitely the hottest band camp I've ever had. They've had to deal with the heat a little more than some of the other. It's better today, but uh, Sunday and Monday was pretty brutal out here, but they, they, they worked through it real well. Band director Dr. Ken Ozello whittled down the competition from 50 potential drum majors to four. Every year we're trying to move the ball forward, so we try to be progressive and, and just get a little better every year. Huntsville High alumna Anthony Bowles worked her way up the ranks. Go Big Red, Roll Tide. From cleaning the band's dirty uniforms to here, the top spot. But stepping out of the shadows requires focus. Remember the hype, remember why you signed the dotted line, um, and get through, the, get through the hard parts so that you can make it to the awesome. That drive and determination comes from a long list of female role models including her mom, Erin Dacey, a former news anchor at Way TV. We wanted it so much for her. And then to see your child be able to achieve their dream, nothing like it. For Sparkman High alum Isaiah Vasquez, his main goal this year is not to waste anyone's time. I have to learn all the signals, all of the protocol, and uh, when a freshman makes a mistake, they can fix it real quick. When I make a mistake, we have to do the rep over again. Drum majors have a lot on their plate. They have to balance schoolwork and leading a group of 400 people. So I had to ask, is it too much pressure? The pressures can become a lot, uh, but personally, I've been here for a long time. So you get used to, okay, you put this in your calendar, you put this in that. On game day, the 400 band members will put the final touches on the halftime show for a crowd of 100,000 cheering fans. For Way 31 News, I'm Demetria Green. We did check with Auburn's marching band, but none of their four drum majors are from North Alabama.